The Mashino culture was an early Iron Age archaeological culture centered in the regions of central and western Russia, particularly around the Upper Don and Oka River basins, between the late 1st millennium BCE and the early 1st millennium CE. The culture is named after the Mashino archaeological site and represents a blend of influences from local forest-dwelling tribes and steppe nomads. It played a significant role in the ethnogenesis of several later groups, including the Eastern Balts, such as the Galandians. The Mashino people relied on a combination of agriculture, animal husbandry, fishing, and hunting. They cultivated millet and barley and kept domesticated animals, such as cattle and horses. The Mashino culture contributed to the formation of the Eastern Balts, particularly the Galandians, a Baltic-speaking group that settled between the Upper Volga and Oka rivers on the territory of modern Kaluga, Moscow, and Tver regions. For this video, I gathered the DNA of a second-century individual from the Vladimir Oblast in central Russia. She was buried alongside eight other people and likely was not a foreigner in Vladimir Oblast. However, her DNA suggests that her origins are very different from the rest of the people buried alongside her in Vladimir Oblast. She seems to descend mostly from Bronze Age protobalts with a minor Siberian component. The rest of the Volgooka genomes show much higher affinities to Siberians. This person was likely the result of mixing between the Uralic Dyakovo culture and the Baltic Mashino culture in Central Russia. Although her DNA doesn't suggest she was fully Baltic, it is obvious that Baltic or perhaps Galindian ancestry was a big part of her ethnic makeup. She carried mitochondrial lineage T2G. She is predicted to have had hazel eye color, dark brown hair, olive skin tone, straight hair texture, and a Greek-shaped nose. Regarding her dopaminergic profile, she is predicted to have been a worrier, which leads to higher dopamine levels and poorer stress tolerance. She is predicted to have had intermediate D2 receptor availability, intermediate odds of autism, and higher levels of empathy. She is predicted to have carried blood type O, which is the most common blood type in Russia. She had a high predisposition to a range of genetic conditions, including hemoglobin E disease, exfoliation glaucoma, male pattern baldness, bipolar disorder, and schizophrenia. She carried rare risk variants for spina bifida. She had lower than average odds for a range of genetic conditions, including kidney stones, erythema nodosum, migraine, gout, Tourette's, epilepsy, leukemia, Alzheimer's, multiple sclerosis, prostate cancer, glioma, thyroid cancer, polycythemia vera, and testicular cancer. You can purchase her DNA file in 23andMe format, along with my trait predictor tool, from links which are in the description.